A new Miami man gets slapped with new charges tonight, including rape, unlawful sexual conduct with a minor, and corrupting another with drugs. Last month, investigators arrested Luke Buchanan after they said he lured children into his shed and sexually abused them. Nine on your side, Jason Law spoke to Buchanan's former neighbors about those new charges. Jason? Clyde and Carol, this is a copy of the new indictment handed down by a Butler County grand jury today. In it are 25 different felony charges against Buchanan. Investigators, some of these crimes go back more than 10 years. Last month, a little boy talked to Nine on Your Side about what he saw inside Luke Buchanan's shed. It was like it had a carpet on the floor, a big TV, um, it had an Xbox, um, it had a couch, chairs, and like Legos was everywhere. This boy's family doesn't believe he is a victim. But Butler County investigators say there are several other boys who were forced by drugs and alcohol into having sex with Luke Buchanan. Last month, Buchanan was charged with 19 felonies. Thursday, an indictment shows the number jumped up to 25. Yes, it really does make me angry, yeah. Especially when you have a parent that's actually calling you saying, oh, you can trust me and the boys will be fine with me. I'll take good care of them and you have nothing to worry about. Lindsey Wilhelm says Buchanan would offer to watch boys in the neighborhood. He would tell them like, oh, well, your son can stay here and he won't get in no trouble. And they got video games and there's food here and I'm making them drinks and Belgian waffles, all that kinds of stuff. Make me feel sick because he was sick. Christopher Callahan lived in the Pines when the shed was brought in. He actually brought the shed and had it put there. It wasn't there when he first moved in. But you no, know, I never went into the shed. I've seen him when they first put brought it over there, but I never um, talked to anybody about it. It's crazy to know he was in this complex, and it's a lot of kids running around through here all the time. They'd be all around the park playing. Last month, investigators confiscated that shed to process it for evidence. That woman we talked to, that neighbor that you just saw in the story, she told us that she's heard more boys are coming forward to talk to investigators here at the Butler County Sheriff's Office. We're live in Hamilton tonight. Jason Law, 9 on your side.